guys, so today I'm going to be doing a tutorial for zebra slash, um, like, paintbrush nails, and this is what it's going to look like. And I'm also doing something which I'm very excited about. I'm going to announce the winner of our giveaway from the Fall Favorites video. So what you were all supposed to do was like the video, add it to your favorites, and subscribe to my channel, and also comment one of your Fall Favorites down below. So um, the four of you who did that have got their names in this hat. And I'll read them out to you. I have got Samantha. Hannah, Chanel, and Alyssa. So these are the four people that I'm going to be choosing out of for the winner of our Fall Favorites giveaway. So they'll be receiving a navy blue Jordana nail polish and a Rimmel uh, eyeshadow palette. And both these things I absolutely love. So, and they're both going to be brand new. So. Um, I'm just going to close my eyes and pick a name out of the hat. Okay, here it goes. And the winner of our Fall Favorites giveaway is... So, the colors that I'm going to be using today are white. And this is a nail polish from Icing, and it's called John Logic. And it's my favorite web that I've ever owned. Um... And I'm also going to be using two nail art nail polishes. And these are called Salon Perfect. And it's a hot pink and black. And they both have very thin brushes, which is what you're going to need. Um, and the last thing I'll be using is just the clear overcoat. So uh, I've already painted my nails with the white. And I love this too. It's such a crisp boy. And it just looks just like this. And the next thing we're going to do is take the black, and um, this is, doesn't have to be perfect at all. This is really just, um, it's supposed to look very messy. So, what we're going to do is I'm going to start with just the ring finger for now. And I'm going to just make dashes across the nail like this. If you do it the opposite way, it will be a little bit thicker. Maybe just because it's more uncomfortable, but I find that it's definitely a little bit thicker when I do it that way. I'm going to take a little bit more nail polish. And we're just really just going to swipe it. You could either do it in the middle or in the end of the nail like this. Strip from the outside corner and go in. Or you could just go ahead and swipe the middle. So I'm going to move on to another nail. I'm just going to show you guys again one more time. Back and forth stripes. Like that. So you're going to do that for all five of your nails. Just to spice up the look a little bit, we're going to take the pink uh, nail art and we are just going to take this ring finger, which is a finger that I most commonly do like nail variations on. So I am just going to take this and we're going to do the same exact thing we did with the black, but with the pink, just to give it a little extra color. But we really want to try to get it like in between the lines of the black, not as a part of them. I'm going to make sure there's not too much nail polish on the brush and then just dive right in. Now I'm going to wipe all the nail polish off the brush, uh, off the pink brush and use it to just spread it out a little bit. Like that. 
So that is our final outcome. And if you want, you can even put it on all the rest of the nails if you feel like they look a little bit too plain. So I think that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to put this pink on all the rest of the nails too. So that's how you add a little pizzazz to the zebra look. But not least, you'll apply a thin top coat of clear. So thank you so much for watching my video on zebra slash paintbrush uh, nails. Um, so that's the final result. And um, also, sorry for keeping you in suspense, but I've got the winner of our giveaway right here. And they are going to receive this navy blue Jordana nail polish and this Rimmel eyeshadow palette. And both these two things are like my favorite stuff that I absolutely love. And it was in my fall favorites video, so if you want to check that out, uh, you can. And also, I apologize for my hair. It's kind of been doing its own thing. But um, our winner is... Chanel! So, uh, thank you so much, Chanel, for entering my giveaway. Uh, congrats on winning these two. You'll receive them ASAP. And I'm um, sorry for all you guys who didn't win, but I'll definitely be having a bunch more giveaways. And there's a real chance for you guys winning, so just uh, do whatever um, in the next giveaway. And I'll put you in the hat and see who wins. So, thank you again so much for watching my video, guys. Uh, subscribe. And follow my channel um, for more cool tutorials, um, giveaways, and stuff like that. And give this video a thumbs up. Bye!